A new report out tonight says billions of dollars in federal contracts meant to help small businesses are actually being awarded to some of the largest corporations in the world. A congressional investigation finds that last year a long list of corporate giants got deals earmarked for the little guys. ABC's John Cochran reports on how these household names are getting richer with your money. Do these look like small businesses to you? Or these? Well, they did to the government, which handed out fat contracts that were supposed by law to go to small businesses. When you look at Microsoft, Google, all those companies, they were never small. They didn't have any right to accept any contract that was supposed to go to a small business. The government awarded small business contracts to some real heavyweights. Microsoft got $475,000. General Electric got $1.9 million. Home Depot got $2.3 million. AT&T got $5 million. Northrop Grumman got $90 million. Susan Hughes runs a small business out of her Virginia home. She lost out on a government contract that went to a large company. I am here today because I want to prevent, if possible, any other small businesses from being victimized by this fraud as my company continues to be. Big companies insist they did not intentionally try to take contracts away from small ones, and that maybe they got some contracts because of clerical errors by the government. A spokesman for Walmart said, people have called us a lot of things, but they've never called us a small company. Investigators found some small businesses that did get government contracts either grew much larger or were purchased by larger firms, which kept the contracts. Congress is considering legislation with heavy penalties for any company that misrepresents its size. It's a matter of fairness, it's a matter of the law. Today's report says small firms lost $12 billion to the big boys. $12 billion of your money. John Cochran, ABC News, Washington.